guys as promised i'll be having another way of discussing this example so um yeah the example noel takes a taxi only if he does not have enough money so first things first we are to identify what the hypothesis is and what the conclusion is so knowing that only if is at the middle of a statement here and only if is under the preserved part it means that Prior to the phrase only if would be the hypothesis, right? So prior to the phrase only if would be our hypothesis. Okay, so let's have the one there, hypothesis. After the phrase only if would be our conclusion. So let's highlight that one. That would be our conclusion if he does not have enough money. That's our conclusion there. Okay. So this time would be if we are to use the connective since at the middle of a statement. So here, if we have here since. Since at the middle of a statement, it's, it's noted there in my other video that the, um, the connective since at the middle of a statement would be under the switch part. It means that it will always be conclusion since hypothesis. So in that case, that should be conclusion since hypothesis there so with this note if we are to be right noel takes a taxi only if he does not have enough money it will be this time the conclusion noel does not have enough money since hypothesis which is he takes a taxi as discussed in my previous video, careful whenever you use pronoun. Do not start with a pronoun because it might not it might not refer to the subject that we're talking about here. So for example, um, although the conclusion here has the word he, we shouldn't start with the statement he here in the sense. It's like saying um he does not have enough money since noel takes a taxi because he there might not refer to noel unlike that if we are to start with noel here since we are really talking about noel then the pronoun he at the latter part of a statement would still be talking about noel okay so we're done with since now would be when now Note that W there in when is in uppercase, so it means that we are to use this time when at the start of the statement. So, when there. It's noted in my previous video that when at the start would be under preserve. It means that it will always be when hypothesis. Comma. Mm -hmm. when hypothesis comma after the comma would be the conclusion there so since when is under the preserve part it will always be when hypothesis comma conclusion that's why we have here in the second statement mm -hmm. here the second statement when noel takes a taxi because after the word when should be the hypothesis the green when noel takes a taxi comma it should be the conclusion which is he will not have enough money okay last part here would be suppose and as here is in uppercase so it means that we are to start with a suppose and still with my previous video 
suppose at the start of a statement would be under preserve so it means that it will be suppose hypothesis comma conclusion so let's have the color there suppose hypothesis um comma next would be conclusion there you go that's why we have here in our answer that when we are to rewrite Noel takes a taxi only if he does not have enough money using the connective or the signal word suppose at the start of the statement it would now be suppose hypothesis which is Noel takes a taxi comma conclusion which is he will not have enough money so there you go different ways to rewrite the the original statement so rewrite it means that we are not to change the concept um the hypothesis and conclusion are the same okay so again if you're still confused just comment down below your 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 questions and i'll try my best to answer your queries all right See you in the next video.